All right, so we're going to take a quick look at how to create a drop down box in Apple's numbers uh, from the iWork package. Let's say we want to use A4 right here and create a drop down box there. It's a little bit different than Excel and it's got a few more limitations than Excel does, but you can still do some pretty cool stuff with it. So uh, up here in the top right, you'll find the inspector. Go ahead and click on that. And now you'll have this little box pop up. Along the top are several different buttons. These are all the different categories. Pretty much anything you're going to change in numbers, you're going to use the inspector to, to set up. You know, if you're going to change the color of a graphic or you're going to work on some of your charts, all of that information is right in your inspector. Uh, you'll want to be on the cell inspector. That's this button here with the little 42 in it. And then cell format, we're just going to go ahead and change to pop up menu. It'll automatically populate a pop up menu with 1, 2, and 3. Uh, I don't want 1, 2, and 3. Those aren't the options I'm going to be using. We're going to be using Porsche and Mustang and Geo Metro. Those are going to be our options for our first list. So here are our options. Very simple to set up and to change. Um, now, if you're going to do this for multiple cells all at once, it's very simple. You highlight all the cells you want to be involved and do the same thing. Go down to pop-up menu, delete these, and throw in some new stuff. And you're good to go.